to the channel again we are on our town hall 15 on public demand i'm just making a, that video again we are sharing with you a top three legend league plus war and you can use in your cwl as well so top three bases in this video so must watch the video till then and if you're new over here you enjoying the bases so guys what are you doing just hit the subscribe guys we're really close to complete 40 000 subscriber family so make sure to hit the subscribe and let's begin the video guys here we go the base number one over here guys and it's in a diamond shape base and diamond shape base is a pretty trending now because diamond shape base is giving lots of value in your defense in a legend league and just check out that base guys first of all the important compartment on a nine o'clock set we placed over town hall in the back side of the town hall compartment you can see all the trapping over here with tornado trap bombs giant bomb rage spell tower two builder hut two red mines with skeleton trap and a monolith it's in a heavy compartment guys and the left and right side compartment of a town hall we place two exos two vis tower two bomb tower two archer tower and one uh, air defense as well and in the outside the wall there we place two cannon over here one cannon over here with a wish tower so pretty much for town hall compartment and just talk about the back side of a town hall compartment a uh, back side of a monolith compartment we place over clan castle with two air sweeper in this box with a two red mine and let's go ahead we place over single inferno with a poison tower with four five black mine in the uh, in this compartment it's uh, pretty heavy with a two red mine as well and one multi inferno with a storage over here one multi inferno but with the storage over here so it is pretty good and one air defense and this side and second air defense on this side so that is it for that core of the base let's talk about the 12 o'clock compartment we place over scatter shot with three hidden tesla xbo cannon archer tower multi motor with some trap giant bomb skeleton trap and uh, some spinning trap as well and one archer tower and a cannon outside the wall there and let's talk about uh bottom side on the three o'clock side we place over eagle artillery with all the heroes so it's again a heavy compartment with two hidden tesla wish tower builder hut air defense two archer tower and two motor outside the wall layer and we place over bombs because lots of people is are trying to charge from that side and that uh, giant bomb and a bomb for that so it's definitely giving you a value let's talk about the six o'clock side again we place over scatter shot expo Cannon Archer Tower Motor West Tower, one cannon, one Archer Tower outside the wall there. So pretty much for that base, let me show you the squad view of the base. Here we go, the clean path of that base, let me show you the walls. Here we go, the walls, it's kind of a diamond shape wall, but there are only few open wall pathing and you can see over here, some open wall pathing from both of the side and that side is totally open and on a download we placed over one more open wall pathing. So it is quite interesting guys. If opponent army is taking a pass, so they will stuck in the walls and definitely you will get a better defense value. And let's talk about the defending CC. Use three eyes, golem five archer, legendary CC, guys. So use it. And let's move into the base number two over here, guys. It's again a box base, a spreaded box base. It's pretty trending because hard to get funnel on that type of bases and hard to create a pathing for your troops. So that is why. That basis is working pretty well. Just check out the town hall compartment. We place two archer tower, two cannon with two builder at few bombs in front of a town hall. In the back side of a town hall, we place over poison tower and a single inferno, two expo, two giant bomb in this compartment. More back side of that compartment, we place over clan castle with monodate, two air sweeper, tornado trap with all the red bombs over here steadily if opponent is doing lalo type of attack and tornado trap take out and then all the red bomb is just crushing the balloon so definitely a great red bomb placement over here more over here in this whole compartment it's in a heavy compartment we place over two expo two multi inferno eagle artillery poison spell tower with two heroes barbarian king and a grand warden with two black man two uh spinning trap in the left and right side you can see the right side of that base on the three o'clock side we place over two hidden tesla Archer tower, two motor and uh, air defense here and here as well. One archer tower, two motor and uh, air defense as well. So it's again a heavy compartment and one scatter shot in this compartment with royal champion with few trapping like uh, spinning trap, skeleton trap and uh, black mine with bomb tower. And uh, on the front side of that compartment, we place over a uh, hidden Tesla archer tower outside the wall layer. Here some defenses as well. One uh, hidden Tesla archer tower air defense with tower cannon as well. On this side again, that is pretty same archer tower 
Hidden Tesla air defense and in the compartment scatter shot with queen with some trapping over here. So it is definitely a good base. Let me show you the squad view of the base. Here we go the total overall a clean pass without any trapping. So just check out that it is quite looking good. And here we go the wall. The main important thing in this base is the wall placement. You can see it's totally clearing a path. If opponent army just go in the path. So definitely is not going for the town hall and it's hard to get funnel why i'm telling you because of the ultimate wall placement in this base just check out the left and the right side both side is just creating a path for troop so definitely troop taking a path and don't go into the mid of the base so it's hard yep if a attacker is pro then it will create a master funneling but if opponent gets mistake on a funneling definitely opponent should uh, punish for that and definitely get failed in this base and uh, let's talk about the defending CZ. Use three eyes golem and five archer again because it's in a beast CZ. And let's move into the last base of the video, the base number three and the golden base. It's again kind of a mixture of box and a diamond shape base, guys. Just check out. There are lots of boxes with a diamond shape. And just check out our town hall compartment on a six o'clock side. We place one hidden Tesla in the corner with a skeleton, skeleton trap and a single red. Bomb with uh, in the town hall compartment, we place two mortar cannon, two wheel tower with two black mine bomb and a giant bomb in the back side of a town hall. We place over monolith, two red bomb with a two builder at more in the core. We place over clan castle with one builder at in the left and right side, two multi inferno, two hidden tesla, two red mines, two builder at two hidden tesla with two heroes as well, royal champion and a queen, and with two range tower. It is a deadly base because Rage Tower is literally insane, guys. Just check out the Rage Tower value, guys. Over here, you can see two X bow, scatter shot, two hidden Tesla, and a multi inferno with builder at inner rate. Same here as well, guys. So the both of Rage Tower is giving you a insane value. And it's kind of an anti-jab titan base. Because there are no value for Jab uh, like a uh, you can just uh, deploy all the spell on a monolith so yeah no no spell tower you will get so yeah it's kind of an anti jab titan base also just check out a uh, 12 o'clock compartment we played over eagle artillery two archer tower with grand warden and a multi inferno with few bomb giant bomb bomb black mine spinning trap red bomb as well with two heroes grand warden and a king and outside the wall that we place two archer tower two cannon as well and let's talk about this compartment. We place a uh, axe bow with cannon and uh, air defense here, same as well. In the corner of the compartment on a nine o'clock side, scatter shot, cannon, wrist tower, bomb tower, mortar, and a uh, one hidden Tesla with few bombs here, as same as well. So, this is definitely the beast base. If you are using in a legend league, you will get a better value, guys. And let me show you the squad view of the base here because the total overall clean pass. Let me show you the walls. Here we go, lots of open wall pathing for confusing opponent troop and you will get a better value, bro. So yeah, my favorite base is number three. Lots of people are just asking, what is the best base we can use? So I'm suggesting you to use base number three in a legend league, especially because it's hard to read and hard to attack. And otherwise, uh, all the one, two bases you can use in a war, it's uh, hard to get three star guys. And again, the defending CC is same as well. Three ice golem and a five archer, use it, enjoy it. And hope you like all the bases. All the bases link provided in the video description. You guys can easily copy the bases and enjoy it. Hope you enjoyed that video. Till now, make sure to hit the like, share and subscribe. Just check out the subscriber account. We are close to complete 40k. Go for it. Hit the subscribe. See you in the next video. Have a nice day. Clash. I love you all.